Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the epic game, the wonderful game that is Let's Play God of War 2. And in the last episode, we went to the old, uh, old the older, the older world. We went to the underverse, as some people that watch Riddick too much would say. And we found that gum Atlas down there just chilling, hanging out. Having a bunch of arms holding the world up, literally. And he helped a brother out, man. A fellow a Greek uh, person out. And, dude, now we have, we are now on our ye old merry way to get, find the sisters of fate and to do whatever it is Kratos is going to do with them. Before we get started, I got to share a story with you. Uh, everybody has had a chance to see that catastrophe that was EA's explanation to Parliament of loot boxes and how they have changed the name to Surprise Mechanics and that whole disastrous thing. Well, while that was terrible and all, when I was watching it the whole time, I was thinking to myself, hey, what's that uh, Korean, Chinese, Japanese girl behind what... The EA representative doing like honey do you want to go out like on a date I'm thinking how do I find this girl? <laughs> right I'm not even listening to what what their face is saying I'm like hmm she looks single I can fix this and I couldn't find a phone number anywhere at all so or if I did she ignored me but anyway the uh yeah, miss her a bunch, and that, that was all great, what EA said, you know, whatever. But that was not the focus of the interview, in my opinion. But anyway, we got Icarus's Icarus wings in the last episode, and now we are like the first person in the history of anything to have gotten up to this point. Like, is that what the game... Uh, That's like what? Yeah, I was about to, no. We're the first person in Greek history ever, in the the ever of e eternity has ever crossed this gorge, and obviously, even with Icarus's wings, we are unable to do it. Oh, I see the way we're supposed to do it now. Dude, we're about to get another health boost, and we are nowhere near a health boost for uh, for the other thing. For, or the, the magic boost. We have crossed the gorge. Palace of the Fates. Oh my goodness. I have come such a long way to find you fine ladies. You don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just hitting like a bunch of stuff. Hope, hoping that... Uh, Let the rage of the titans fuel your blades. Oh boy. I'm going to need that. I'm just going to do it right now. Just, just get it out, out of the way. 100%. Oh, they can still hurt me in Rage of the Gods mode, right? Or can they? I don't think they can. Yes, they can. Don't even know what I was thinking. Like, absolutely being a fool for the city right now. But it don't matter, because I done got me another Gorgon Eye. I only need like a hundred more. Okay, that, that is fantastic. Now, I'm going to go with Thanos' Rage, or whatever it's called, with the whole... Uh, the whole uh, electroshock therapy thing. So, that's just my bag. That's not. That's not everybody's bag. Some people probably dig seismic charges and whatnot. I'm not. It's not my thing, man. It might be your thing. It ain't my thing. So, we can still be friends, agree to disagree, and all that. Come on, come on, you guys. Come on, do something. Okay, I. I'm too good for them. I know when they're going to attack, and... Oh my gosh, did you see freaking missiles coming out of nowhere, dude? I want to know, wow, who gave you permission to do that? And I want to know right now, it wasn't me or my mother, so who could it have been? It's kind of hard to... Well, it's probably not hard to block. But even when I know it's coming, it's still like, is it really going to hit me? And then I, uh, I think I hear another Cyclops or something. Something is... Oh! <laughs> I'm like... 
right, you dang cyclops of death. What is this? What is this tag team BS, man? That's not fair. Freaking tag teaming losers over here. They're teaming worse than Friday the 13th when it first started with all the freaking Jason teamers, and they're probably still around somewhere. I can I can tell when he's about to attack because dude like does a thing on top of the whoop on top of the head of the dude. Oh he's already dead. Oh boy, now I can't telegraph his moves. Oh he's dead too. Great. Didn't get the eyeball. Hopefully there is more people, more cyclops eye out there. What have you cats been up to? I've been playing a ton of Guitar Hero and Guitar Hero Metallica. Like a bunch. So, uh, yeah, that's what I've been doing, and it's been good. I've been doing a great job. I've just about gotten every achievement in Guitar Hero Metallica, which I feel like that's quite the achievement. But then again, I always thought Metallica was the harder of the Metallicas. Or the, yeah, yeah, of the. Ah harder of the guitar heroes and it's just weird i never thought i would even get close to 100 percenting it but after i had bought a drum set pretty much had enough for uh to pretty much handle every everything and you know i've got a crew that i play with and we play very very regularly on guitar hero and it's fantastic i, I feel like there's not a lot of people that have people to really play Guitar Hero with in this day and age, especially regularly. So we've uh, pretty much taken care of business as far as achievements and, and doing things online with Guitar Hero goes. Where is this door? Okay, I was about to get a little frustrated and make, make a bunch of mistakes on the internet. Probably post some freaking social security numbers and nudes. No, I probably wouldn't have done that, but... Okay. 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 <laughs> I know what's going on here. I'm not stupid. Okay? The floor is about to become lava, I believe. Can we upgrade the Blades of Chaos one more time? Yes, we can! Oh, my goodness. What do I get? Increased damage. Tartarus Rage. Tartarus Rage and Air. Prometheus Inferno. Ooh, I like it. And it's maxed out. Oh, my goodness. I've never done this before. Ever, it says like hold this to do something, or I want to know how to do that. Um, change weapon, power up. Uh, where's the moves? Okay, there we go. Magic, don't need my relics, don't need that. Okay, this isn't happening. It's Athena's blade. Okay, okay, Charter's Rage. It was like hold L1, and that was it, or something. Half L1, Athena's reverse, yeah, I know what that is. Icarus lift. Okay, so pretty much just hit the square button. Square and triangle. And that'll that'll do it. It said to hold the L1 for something, or was it L1 and That might be what it is. I don't know. I know there's gonna be some spikes coming out here and I don't like that. So let's uh, let's work through this nightmare real quick. Mm. Yeah, that's great. That makes me happy. More than likely, there are going to be some instant kills, I would say. I need to figure oop, figure out the pattern here. Excuse me. Oh my god. Well, at least they're not instant kills. That's good. Like, there has to be a bit of a. So, I tried to block that. I saw that coming. I just. Oh no! <laughs> so there has to be uh oh. relentless. I would like to know which do ah yes. Yes, 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 yes. Give me get oh, what's that? Hard to crank him. Nice. What can I do with it though? Oh no! Oh my god. Oh my don't make me choose between the crank handle 
and the souls, because I will probably pick the souls. Probably haven't even upgraded. Okay, so I would recommend staying... Excuse, excuse me, you didn't give me a chance to even move. Okay, I think I've... I think I kind of get the pattern a little bit here. And it's going to go behind me. Oh, nope, no, don't get the pattern. Still don't know the pattern. Okay, we will figure it out. But I'm going to stay as close as possible to this. Okay, got that. Now give me this, please. I figured it wouldn't, like... Like, part of me was thinking that it, for while I was in that room, it would uh, stay open for an infinite amount of time. I gotta get in there. But it did not do that, unfortunately. I need, I need that, please. I need it. I need it. I need to get out. Thank you. Oh, no. Dude, if they would have froze me in that, I, you would have seen one upset human being. Like, big time. Now, which way is the way to go? Is the more important question. I can't avoid these spikes, and they're not even moving. Never-ending turning of the... I gotta get over there. I gotta get over there. I'm about to say that probably locked that in place. Heck yeah! Freaking Greek puzzles! <laughs> I am better than any puzzles! Heck, dude, if I can beat Dante's Inferno on the hardest difficulty. Yeah, that was that was an ordeal. I had a really hard time with that. So yeah, after this, the plan, ladies and gentlemen, is to do... I've got three achievements left in Metallica, and probably the hardest one's going to be doing Dyer's Eve, getting the, the points. I don't need that. Save that for a better... Whoop! Hang on, before we go there. You gotta get like 450,000 points on Dyer's Eve, and you have to... Well, yeah, that's it. As the drummer. But, and you can do it on medium, it's possible, but the thing is, the pedal that I have is extremely sensitive. Like, it double hits when it should just be like a single hit. So I break my combo constantly as the drummer, so it's a good thing that it can be done on medium, because I like really gotta focus on not hitting the kick too hard. Um, I worked it out, but it could be better. Like, that's the only issue with that is... You see, you know, a lot of people probably don't think about it either. See, I, I'm a real drummer, too. When I was making my own music, I had to learn how to do beats and, like, really play drums. But, um... When you're able to, like, really customize a kit to, like, where, you, like, your body naturally, like, wants the pad to be, like, whenever you do fills or whatever, and you get your double kick, like, the way you want it, where you want it to where you can you know hit like be in time as consistently as possible um whenever you go from that having that level of customization the way of like where your foot rests on the pedal when you go from that to having this really constrained area of playing drums so you pretty much have no customization options as far as the guitar hero and rock band for that matter drum set goes and the pedals are like this. They're literally, you have to play them side by side if, you know, unless you have something to, like, hold them. Because you can't, like, I do mine at, like, angles like this. My left foot goes here, my right foot goes here, and, you know, they're at, like, a diagonal. Uh, to go from that to, like, flat is very difficult, but the problem is the kicks I have now, well, one kick has already stopped working, and I just bought it. Uh, but the one that it came with works but is so sensitive and the way I like to play I like to keep my foot on the pedal like rested on the pedal when I need to hit it I lift it up and then come back down but I always rest it like on the front edge of it this one like you can honestly you can be like resting on it and if you like if your foot just slides one way or the other it doesn't even have to lift up it'll like trigger it once maybe twice so like it's a really sensitive uh, pedal so, like, I can't play it normally, first of all. That's 
the biggest issue. I can't just like leave my foot rested on the the tip of the pedal. And I can't hit it too hard or it registers it twice. So it came down to, well, I can't play like a eight minute song with my left or my right leg like held up in the air and just like barely tapping it whenever I need to do it. I cannot do that. So what I did was I, I put a pillow under my thigh. That way it's like resting in midair like this and whenever I need to hit, like I just lean forward a little bit. That was not good, it did not work. It was the most comfortable way I could play. So what I eventually happened was, okay, can I put something underneath the pedal? I tried that, didn't work, wasn't even almost registering, like in between the, like a piece of cloth or something in between the pedal and the sensor. That way when I hit it, like it would register it very lightly. That didn't work. Um, so ultimately, what I decided to do was back my foot off of the pedal to rest it kind of towards the back and whenever I hit it like come down as hard as I normally would and I'm actually able to rest it now and it only maybe triggers it like maybe 50% of the time like double like I'm still really careful like really conscientious about it but that's what the problem is gonna be going into Dyer's Eve is I shouldn't have to think about where my foot is or how much pressure I'm gonna put down on the pedal. I, that shouldn't even come into the equation. The only thing that should come into the equation is timing. But because the pedal's so sensitive, I'm constantly going to be thinking about, like, oh, I don't want to hit this, don't want to hit the pedal too hard, don't want to hit the pedal. And instead of, like, all right, uh, hi-hat symbol, hi-hat symbol, you know, actually timing things. So I feel like Dyer's Eve is going to be exceptionally harder for me as it would be for other people because of how sensitive pedal is what i may end up doing though i may end up putting like another piece of cloth because the cloth i had there before was really thick so like even when i was nailing this thing like it wasn't coming through but i think if i put like a thinner piece it may work like a rag or something or like maybe double up a rag like a thin rag that might actually be better and i can play more comfortably and like you know not have to worry about things but if i can do dyer's eve high score no problem on the race achievements. I've got friends helping me out on those, but still, it's uh, wish me luck, ladies and gentlemen. It's still going to be a situation. What is this? Carving of uh, Boris, the god of North. I break this. I want to break this. Uh, where do we go from here? Looks like we got some doors. We need warrior skull to unlock doors. We got fire over here. We got a lever here. Ah, yes. Okay. Okay, well this is getting confusing. I need the key of the ram. Dude, what is... I got the crankshaft thingy, which is fantastic, but what is that for, though? Like, what... There may be a thing... Ah, right here. Handle the crank. All right. See, like, what if I I didn't do that first thing going into that room? Like, I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Like, what, oh, it's taking the fire away. I can't make that jump. I cannot make that jump. Like, oh, wait, Icarus, that's right. Um. Oh, I guess I can't make that jump. There is so much more to this game than uh, the first God of War. It's just so much more in depth, really. And there's all these different items. Okay, so now that we've maxed out a thing as well, I am going to finish uh, Chronos' Rage, I believe. I feel like that is the most useful thing in the entire game. Oh, look! So, yeah, so while it's saving, another story. I was, I was at work today, and uh, right before I left, this gorgeous model walked in. It had to be a model. There's no other way. And I'm thinking to myself... Okay, um, if she needs anything, like, if she wants to know where the jalapenos are, or if she needs, like, some balloons blown up with helium, like, that's all good and all, but the only thing I'm going to be able to say to her is, yes, I'm single. Like, there's no other, even if I'm not, like, that is the only answer that my body can produce at this moment with her in my life, in front of me. So... Luckily, she didn't need anything. 
and uh, and I didn't have to uh, put my foot in my mouth. Luckily, but I would have. I would have gladly. I don't care if she was married. That is just a formality. Okay, what am I? Oh no! Is there a way to slow down time? Because this is this is gonna be. Oh, it's on the other side. Is anything else open? Like, I really can't come back the way I came. I can't do that. Can I go through here, though? Um, so that was exciting. I had a great day today. Freaking throwing a dang old truck of frozen and... Like, I know I'm supposed to probably fly through there. Yes, I'm supposed to do that. But I'm gonna, there's gonna have to be some slow time involved here. Oh wait, no there's not. No there is not. I just need to be extremely fast. That That is it. That is just as quick as anyone has ever go up as high as I can and just get in there oh my goodness freaking Kratos flying Falco McFox oh my goodness. there is just so much I like these Athenian <laughs> upgraded blades man oh, Hello. my soon to be dead friend there is no escape of the murder of your face I have missed you guys. I haven't been recording as much as I would have liked to have been, and I honestly don't have a good excuse. Just like last time, I don't know. I haven't felt too terribly bad recently. I just haven't been... I don't know what the word is. Anybody else been locked down in Earth Defense Force? Like, I, I feel like I got hoodwinked, man. I just got out of a grind fest relationship known as Injustice 2. I didn't I don't want to walk into another one. Okay? I didn't pay for that. It's not what I want. But here we are. Ah, oh, I see. I need to put that into that hole. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Been there before. Didn't do it. Auditorium Auditorium of a person. What is this? Can he not read? Wait, what? There's nothing. Oh, okay. It's written a language you can. Oh, <laughs> I can't read that language. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay, let me see here. Let me use the knowledge that I have gained of my 26 years of living to beat this puzzle quicker than anyone has ever beaten it before. I like this place. <laughs> and immediately just change di diagram frames, whatever, just into another paradigm. I like this. What is this? <gasps> That's a girl. Okay. What? Okay. Okay. Calm down. Okay. It's okay. It's fine. Uh, there may be boobs. It's it's a little late, all things considered. Um, gonna make a note here just in case. Got to do some edits. You never know. Hey, there's a friend that I play all the time with. All right. All right, honey. I am ready for some McLovin'. What do you Please got? Please be beat. That's a guy. Okay, never mind. <laughs> all right. He's just hanging out here, though. Okay, how exactly? Am I supposed to grab him? kind of slams him down. Like, that's a human being, Kratos. What are you doing? Um, I thought for a second that fire might be able to lift me up. Is there a place to slow down time? Okay, 
a language I don't understand, written in a time that I wasn't there for. Hmm. <laughs> this doesn't sound too good. Oh! I got it. Makes perfect sense to me now. Gotta move me some rocks, man, and no, not Dwayne Johnson. So, anyway. so what else have you been up to, Sam? Dude, I ain't been doing nothing. I, I seriously, I've been playing Guitar Hero with my mates, and that is, that is it. Haven't been playing World War Z. Want to get back into it. They released some uh, update or DLC package or something. Well, it definitely wasn't DLC. I'm hope it was like 14 gigs though. I don't know what they did, but 14 gigs worth of game change. And I was I'm thinking to myself, okay, what could they have done? And I I am just praying so hard that the, all they did was like rebalance the freaking bulls. You must protect. The I do not oh, want to die. You're not going to. But if I keep slamming you down like that, I'm surprised you don't lose any health that way. Dang translator. Thinks I won't kill him. Better be translate some stuff. Oh, we're not done here, are we? The dogs of war have cried havoc. Okay, so anyway. What was I talking about? Oh, yeah, hopefully they balanced it out, dude. Because I was talking to somebody else about that. I was, uh... I'm saying, yeah, this game is fantastic. It's... It's Left 4 Dead 3. Like, that is that is it. And it's, it's, it's one of the best games ever. And you definitely need to get it if you haven't already. <coughs> and, uh... I need, to, I need to learn how to block here. Probably need to move this guy situation because he is just getting absolutely demolished here. I like that move. That move might be extremely useful against these dudes that incessantly block. See what I'm saying? Like it forces them into a position where they have to... Okay, let's get you out of here before more people... So I'm hoping, please to make some balancing issues. I was talking to that guy. I was like, yeah, this game is fantastic. It's just like it three, you know? It's good. I oh, no. The world while they attack. It's good and all, but the problem is... Um, yeah, this dude is giving me a rash right now. It's like, yeah, I, I don't need you to stay alive, dude. I just need you to read the words, please. This, this guy is being a buzzkill. Right now. That's what I'm saying. I'm going to have to go raise the gods or something. Because this is... His health is not too high. And it's causing me some... Pro Ooh! What is that? Du wait, what? Dual shot control? What? Too many things are happening at one time. Oh, so when I'm in Rage of the Gods mode, I can do a, a Titan Wrath, whatever it's called. I can do whatever it was that... I was telling him, I'm like, yeah, it's got just some serious balance issues. Other than that, it's the best game ever. And I was telling him this story, if I can ever finish this. Story. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, what's he doing? He's sucking my magic. I don't like that. I'm telling this story about how I was like the only guy left on the team alive. And I was trying the best I could to save my friends. And, uh... I... I have forgotten the words. Oh, no. Well, you're gonna need to remember. You can learn today. All right. Try to remember, Read please. It. Hear me, sisters who control the threads. Keep going. Oh, hey, excuse me. Okay. Well, I got in the video anyway. 
So, the situation is, I was the only person left on my team, and the game insisted on spawning three bulls and two lurkers. Both can insta down, well, not insta down me, but in cap me immediately to where I can't do anything. Killed one of the bulls, killed one of the lurkers, but had to reload sometime and freak. Oh, God. And he said, dude, that is, that is unrealistic. And I explained to him that the bulls replaced the chargers and the lurkers replaced the hunters. But they do the exact same thing. And he's like, man, that's bull. I'm like, yeah, I know. But it's a fantastic game. But anyway, thank you for watching. Keep it real, keep doing it. See you catch Kins in the next episode. It's my absolute pleasure. Keep it real and peace.